What's up, YouTube? I'm G Infinite. Today, we'll be exploring Falcon, uh, known as Samuel Wilson. Uh, definitely going to talk about his relationship to Captain America and, of course, these two good friends and war veterans. Um, I'm going to get into a little bit of every single figure that was dropped by Toy Biz and Hasbro on Falcon. So today's episode is on yours truly, Falcon. All right, guys. So today I'll be discussing Falcon. The first Falcon that I really wanted to talk about is done by Toy Biz, the originator. Uh, Toy Biz dropped this Falcon uh, from the Mojo series. And one of the coolest things is that Toy Biz is known for dropping a regular Falcon. Sorry about that. And also a variant Falcon. The one that you're looking at here, that try not to stay still, but the one you're looking at here is a variant Falcon. Very, very cool. Um, this variant, one thing that I like the, about it is the actual outfit. Um, if you notice there on the outfit, on the chest piece, it's covered in white all the way from the center of the chest to the face mask. And of course, in the center there, you see kind of like a star almost uh, in gold. And then for Sam Wilson, who's Falcon, uh, you see him in a lot of the uh, Captain America issues because he's one of Captain America's good friends and they've fought Red Skull together and many other villains together. So getting back into this figure, uh, love what they did with the outfit in the in the sides here on the abdomen. They gave him a little bit of white, if you notice. And then one thing that this figure has is that the wingspan is a lot longer in the variant. If you notice here, the wingspan is a little bit longer. Also, the wingspan is not connected. So if you're looking at the figure, the wingspan right here uh, is not connected. This back portion of the wing is actually connected to the arm piece um, that you see there on the on the on the on the tricep. So it's pretty cool. If you're looking at the back of the figure, kind of like the same thing here. I have him posed on one of the old school toy biz. Uh, so he can actually stand in a flight position. So if you're looking at him from there in the back, you see the red pattern and you see that white pattern there uh, a little bit more. And of course, um, most of the time Falcon is up in the air, uh, flying around. So that's a really cool touch to this Falcon. Uh, I also noticed there, if you notice, you see kind of like his earpieces coming out, uh, from the mask. So this is a really, really cool Falcon. I love what they did with their variant only because the wingspan is extremely long, as you see there. And then, of course, um, he comes with the Falcon, uh, which is known as Red Wing. Uh, the Falcon is known as Red Wing, and he was always fascinated with Falcon. So that's where he got that alias Falcon, the name Falcon. Um, if you're looking at the other Toy Biz sculpt here, uh, one thing that you'll notice about this one is that it is a little bit different. Here on the chest piece, there's no white in it. Uh, you see more of his chest and the muscles there. Um, and of course, on the bottom here of the abdomen, he has almost like a red kind of uh, logo there. So that's pretty cool. One thing that you also notice is that uh, over here in the back, in the back piece, there's a small hole there to attach the red uh, red wing, the Falcon red wing. So you'll see him flying up in the air, of course, every time Falcon is around. And, and of course, most of the time Falcon is fighting, you'll notice also red wing with him. So this is really, really cool. I like this figure, but I noticed one thing on the boots here. Instead of the variant being all red on the boots, you see a little bit of that gold trimming there. Um, and another thing is the wingspan is a little bit shorter on this one, not as long as the other Falcon that you noticed the wingspan was a little bit longer on over here. The wingspan is a little bit shorter. So this is a really, really cool Falcon. This was done by Marvel Legends Toy Biz, and this is from the Mojo series Falcon. All right, guys, so the next Falcon is from a box set that comes with Vision, and it comes with Kate Bishop, also known as the female Hawkeye. So this is a really, really cool um, Sam Wilson in the traditional 
uh, Captain America attire. You see Falcon here. He has like the face sculpt. You notice there. Very, very cool. He has like the goggles on, which are red. And then the face mask is white. And you notice on the side there, the ears are coming out of the face mask, which is pretty cool. Getting into this figure, one of the figures that, one of the facts that I really like this is because this is Falcon when you see him the first time with that Captain America outfit. Um, and, and you notice that Captain America has passed on the mantle to Falcon, which looks really cool because you notice here um, the silver straps that he has up here. That's actually uh, for the wings uh, that he uses to fly. So this figure, unfortunately, did not come with the wingspan, which that would have been really, really cool if they would have done like some metallic wings. Uh, just to to make the figure look a little bit more like that Falcon that we all know and um, One thing that I do like is uh, They gave him there like on the center of the belt. He has that metal piece there and you notice on the knee padding here He has some metal plates um, Which that's really really cool. Of course. They gave him that Captain America look the center of the chest you see the star there and you see like almost these li these lining patterns going uh, into the star, which is really, really cool. Uh, the traditional uniform is that red, white, and blue. And you notice there on the abdomen, he has those Captain America colors of the red and white. Uh, the gloves as well are a red, solid red color. And as far as the boots is the same thing. The only thing that the boots have a little bit of lining there. And he does have the traditional Captain America shield, which is uh, the red, white, and blue. So this Falcon is really, really cool. This was done by Hasbro. And if you look at the back there, you notice that he has kind of like some type of uh, belt with uh, compartments there to put ammunition or whatever he decides to carry. And you also notice that in the back over here, you see that red, that metallic uh, straps there that are going across. Kind of like to show that he does have uh, that pack with the wings. So really, really cool figure. Just wish it would have came with the actual wingspan so he can uh, kind of like have him posed up flying around. But this is a very, very rare figure because it does come in a box set with Vision and Hawkeye and like I said it is difficult uh, to get because and and for those of you that don't know you should get this figure um, it has a lot of tie-ins with uh, the movie I don't want to spoil it for you guys but uh, like I said this is Falcon in the traditional Captain America costume so this is done by Marvel Legends Hasbro and this comes in a box set with Vision and Kate Bishop also known as Hawkeye all right, guys, so the next figure that I want to talk about is the Walmart exclusive Marvel Legends Falcon. Uh, this is from the Civil War, the movie. Um, and this Falcon is pretty cool because he does bring back some of the concepts of the comics. Um, like when in the old school comics, he had Red Wing. Here you see um, he's holding a mechanical Red Wing. Um, of course, it's not similar to the actual Falcon, but it's pretty cool the way they brought it back uh, with some type of uh, sophisticated mechanics. And you're looking here at Red Wing. He usually, you usually see uh, it flying around and really, really cool because it does uh, also fire uh, at the enemies and it has weapons uh, inside of it. So that's a cool Red Wing uh, and a cool way to bring him back out um, in the movie from the MCU, the Civil War. And then here, you notice Falcon has the traditional goggles there um, that you see in the MCU with the uh, red in the inside of the eyes. And then, of course, I like what they did with the chest piece there. They gave it that dark gray and some red patterns there with silver lining inside of it. And you're looking at the arms. The arms also have that red pattern outline and they are gray and then if you notice the platelet here on the forearm uh, has that silver and black on the hands and then you see of course on the bottom here he has small kind of belt with some silver there and then 
the legs, uh, the majority of the legs right here are black. And then, of course, you see that armored out uh, gray there with the knee pads. And on the bottom of the very boot, you'll notice that red straps there. So really, really cool. One of the best things about this figure is that they actually gave him the backpack on the wingspan. And you notice the wings, they made it look really cool because it has that outline of black. But on the inside, it's that gray and red um, to bring out the, those colors because we do know that traditionally he had red as regular Falcon. So it's pretty cool the way they brought out that red and incorporated it into a modern way. And then here you see the wingspan, which is really, really uh, amazing. One of the best things about the wingspan is that this is detachable. So you can actually take out that that jet pack that he uses where the wings come out. Um, there's two holes in the, in, the, in the back portion. So when you pull it out, uh, and I'll show you guys real quick, when you do pull it out, um, you can reattach it. So that's, that's pretty cool. Um, and then, of course, I wish they would have done that with the Captain America Falcon. But like I said, um, this is a really well done um, Falcon from the Civil War. And this is done by Marvel Legends Hasbro. All right, guys. So the next Falcon, uh, one of the Falcons that I like, um, out of most of the Falcons, I really like this Falcon. I like the way, uh, the appearance, they made him look very realistic, more movie-like than anything. And this is, uh, the first time you see the Falcon. This is from Marvel Select, and this is the Falcon from the Winter Soldier. So um, I just love that they gave him that army fatigue, um, old school army colors there. You see the, the gray and black fatigues, and um, he just looks really, really cool. And then you notice he has like the straps for the jetpack that he has with the wings there, and the wingspan looks really, really cool. I like the the goggles that they gave him. Of course, you see those, and, and and it's just a really nice touch because the outlining of the goggles are black. But you know that he has these sophisticated goggles, kind of like to see, uh, you know, different things or uh, maneuver himself, so he knows that the enemies are surrounding him or whatever it may be. So that's really cool. Um, and then the belt here, you notice, has a lot of buckles there. Very very cool buckles. And not only that, but if you notice, he has there like almost like these um, plates there on the shoulders to protect the shoulder blades. And he has really cool like pads on the knees there. So um, one thing that really stuck out also is the American flag. You notice he has it right there on the uh, embroidered on the pants and it just looks really cool. And then he has those boots with some straps there. And if you're looking at the wingspan, you notice the little thing in the back there, the silver mechanics that it has right there in the back. And if I turned around, it's just really, really tough. They made that jet pack look pretty amazing. Love what they did with the red lining there and the, and the gray. It just gives him more of that Falcon appearance. He looks very realistic. So this is the Falcon that was done by Marvel Select, um, and definitely one of my favorite Falcons. Now, I did add weapons to him. I did give him kind of like um, some futuristic guns there. Uh, we know Falcon usually uses like two weapons at the same time, whether he's firing, you know, uh, Uzis or whatever the case may be. It just looks really, really cool. And you notice there he has, usually he has like two pistols in hand. So I decided to go a little bit more futuristic and give him these weapons. Now these weapons, uh, for those of you that don't know, came from an old grifter, grifter who was bought, uh, bought by DC, but uh, nevertheless, a really cool character. So I decided to take the guns from grifter who was part of the Wildcats and and just put it on Falcon. So if you're looking for that, um, you could definitely get it from an old school uh, grifter. And that's from uh, from the Wildcat series. But like I said, this Falcon, one of my favorite Falcons, it was done by Marvel Selects. All right, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this episode on Falcon, uh, also known as Sam Wilson. Uh, Falcon being the best friend to Captain America and definitely a big influence. So uh, please subscribe, 
hit that bell for the next notification and definitely hit us with a like. And for now, watch a six. I'm G Infinite. Peace out, YouTube.